Hey everybody, what is going on? Um, so recently, the Fire TV Cube, and uh, I wanted to do a quick unboxing. Uh, so, we wanted to check this out, and it just came out on Thursday, June 21st, 2018, and want to check it out and see what all comes in the box so I'm gonna go ahead and rip off everything that keeps it in there there's hi Kendall hi. <laughs> so of course Amazon always with their fire products always wants to give you a nice little box here um, you have your UPC code and all that fun stuff and Amazon on the bottom there uh, let's I don't really want to rip the box so I want to try to find out ah I gotta take this out here all right all right so first you open it up and of course you got your fire TV cube in there and of course the orange and black and they even have you can't see it yep there you go you can kind of see it Amazon has their own little little signature logo there as usual so here here's the fire TV cube um, let's t let's take this out real quick it's uh, kind of sticky back there it's just oh I see I was ripping off the instructions that they have on there it does feel like a pretty pretty nice quality build um, they even have the small little feet on there. Um, it tells about your Fire TV Cube proper placement. Um, at least one foot away from speakers, not in a closed cabinet. Unobstructed and facing where you sit. So there's that guide. Of course, it's kind of turned around for the webcam there. So yeah, I'll go ahead and take that off there. Oh, it's wrapped around the entire unit. That's very small. Very small. Kindle says it's very small. It's smaller than the box. Yeah. So there you go. Amazon loves to put their all of their stuff on there. So what else do we get in the box? A box. It tells you um, power adapter, optional IR extender cable, and optional Ethernet adapter. Of course, I think that's a good thing because be hardwired is going to be your best bet. So um, here's your optional Ethernet adapter. I've not used one of these before, so I'm going to check it out. Um, the IR extender cable, as you would expect, just a little IR reader there. And you have your power adapter, of course, with the big old Amazon block. Um, and that's it for that box. You also get batteries. We get batteries, Kindle Free says. Free batteries. Free batteries, it should be. Um, of course, you got the Amazon branded batteries that come with the unit. And, and the tiny remote. Yep. The Alexa remote. We'll mess with that later. And some random papers. We got some random papers. We have a Fire TV Cube. I'm guessing this is your um, quick quick guide manual. Um, you have another another neat little um, 
not really sure. I think it's more, more or less, it's just kind of telling you what you can do with it. Um, and then you have your legal, legal paperwork. And all the words and are backwards. that is it. No, we also get a box. We also get a box. So that's it. Um, I will do a review what I think about the Fire, Fire TV Cube. Um, a disclaimer on this is uh, this can output um, 4K content. However, I do not even own a 4K TV. So, um, is that something that stopped me? No, absolutely not because it's uh, future proof at this point. So we will see we will see how the Fire Cube TV um, or Fire TV Cube, sorry, um, works. I've never used an Alexa device before, so this is a first. All right, thank you guys for watching and I'll make another video and once I figure it out. Thanks guys. Bye.